kind of been a minute since we had an overhead view, right? So right now, I'm about to roll up some, not even roll up, I'm about to grind up some Three Kings. I'm not a fan, it's very, uh, very leafy. I don't know if it's the trim. So we're gonna grind this up. Now let's go. All right, so if you guys live in New York right now, you probably know how hot it is, it's fucking, it's ridiculously hot. It's like Satan's fucking ass hole. But uh, today I wanted to talk to you guys about something that I felt was really important. And that topic is, hey guys, under YouTube's content guidelines, I'm letting you know that I do not promote the use of cannabis or any other type of mind altering substance. So without further ado, if you're not 18 and up, go play Minecraft. It's fake Delta 8 carts. This is gonna be something that New York and all the legal states need to look out for. Because, no, not even the illegal states, because Delta 8 just became something that, you know, I feel like is gonna take over. Somebody in my comments has said something about the regulations of Delta 8. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put the actual comment right here so you guys can read it. But the comment made sense to me. I'm like, okay, there's a whole bunch of new companies coming out of the woodworks because Delta 8 is the next best thing, right? So that means you have a whole bunch of ripoff companies like this where you get your distillate that looks just like this. Tell me if you guys would fucking smoke this. Because I didn't know no better, I had bought this and thought this was Delta 8, the real, like the real deal. It wasn't. Because I made that mistake, I guess I'm informing you, like don't make the same mistake. Hold, Hold on. on. Wait. Wait. Let's continue this talk. Let's just get baked first. Yo, what I like about this weed is it's very, very sticky. Oh my gosh. That's like borderline sex. Grab your lighters and you know what Tom and Eddie mean? Cheers. Back to this fucking crisis. I literally bought this thinking that it was Delta 8 because I've never smoked Delta 8. You feel me? Like, you know, when you go into a dispensary, you buy CBD for the first time. You never smoke CBD. So literally, they can sell you anything. This shit right here is no bueno. I literally took a couple puffs of this shit, like big fucking rips. And I'm like, why does it, it doesn't taste right. And I know for a fact, THC cards that are liquidy like this, nigga, I will never smoke that shit. But I thought because, you know, fuck, it's Delta 8. Maybe it's different. It's supposed to be. So I smoked it and somebody made a video and I watched it and I was just like, oh shit, my Delta 8 did not look like that. And uh, that's when, uh, if you guys didn't see the video, this video right here was made. I finally got the Delta 8 Moonwalker. That is a company that is reputable for me. I knew about them already. And I walked into the smoke shop and found it. So I was like, yeah, I definitely gotta get that. Cause I do know I've seen videos on that product alone. But this came from some random ass company and I don't I don't really know. Hopefully I can find this dude. I could show you guys. Hold on. It's kicking my ass real quick. Hopefully I can find the brand that distributed this to my smoke shop because now when Delta A is on the table, why am I still holding? When Delta A is on the table now and people start buying these fake cards and let's say these fake cards kill, they're trying to like make Delta A illegal. So imagine when it actually the fake cards actually do damage, bro. What? Moral of the story, guys, is watch out for Delta 8 cards that are runny. Make sure that the, that they have a, make sure that they have this. If they don't have a QR code where you can scan it and verify it through like actual scientists or anybody who was working on it in a lab, I don't think it's a good idea to smoke it. So this right here, garbage. It shouldn't make it no further than the smoke shop, honestly. It shouldn't even make it in the smoke shop, but I'm very glad that I tried Moonwalker Delta 8. I'm not sponsored by them. This is not a sponsored video, nothing, nothing like that. But I can like, I can actually say this shit fucking slaps. Like CBD, when you try it, it's like, I don't really know if I felt anything. This, you know, like, you know. But guys, with that being said, I know this is a short video, but I just wanted to inform you guys about these fake Delta 8 cards that can maybe kill, who knows? I don't know, clickbait or what? As always, stay 420 friendly. That anti-social.